Hello, appreciate you stopping by to visit with me today. My name is Seth Reynolds. I'm known as the Entrepreneurial Pastor, and I'll be talking about some information that I hope you'll find valuable, uh, especially if you're new to the network marketing arena, uh, you've been involved with network marketing for a long time, perhaps you have. Um, my background has been as an entrepreneur and a pastor uh, for 22 years as a pastor, but an entrepreneur way, way before that, back into my college days, and you can tell by the gray that I have my uh, just above my lip there, <laughs> that I'm not just a young guy, been around for a long time in the uh, network marketing arena. i uh, been able to identify some uh, characteristics that help us to succeed in anything that we do in life, and especially in the area of business. In the area of business, uh, in regard to network marketing, it is really a three simple steps that people utilize. And uh, you, you can say, you can call them anything you want, but there are three basic steps that people utilize in, in network marketing that makes it uh, makes it exciting, makes it fun, but makes it profitable at the same time. First of all, is using a product. A real simple project. Have you come across any product that you're going to be utilizing? If it's going to be a weight loss product or it's going to be any health and nutrition product, if it's going to be a diet product or whatever, it's going to be a diet situation, weight loss, same thing, uh, whatever, whatever product it's going to be. If it's going to be coffee or whatever, use the product. So if it's a service, use the service. And here's the good thing about it. Often I, I've joined companies and just to use the product because I thought the product was something that, that was very, very useful, beneficial for myself. Uh, there's some, some companies I never actually have actually activated myself as a, a representative, but I use the product continually, even today. Some I've had for 10, 15 years that I continue to use the product, but I'm not the person to be able to go beyond that because that particular product is something that is personal for me that I use. Now, in the area of network marketing, if you find a product that is very useful for you, and you find it, and you, if you find yourself wanting to be involved in business, and that particular product is something that you feel like you can recommend, that would be the second thing you want to do is recommend the product. And again, even if you use the product and you recommend it, if your product you're plugged into the system that the company has, I mean their affiliate program or their network marketing project, uh, you'll be able to recommend the product and be compensated for doing that because it's really a simple thing. We use the product, of course, we buy it, we pay for it every month or every every time we use it. Every time we have it, we, uh, we, we pay for it once a month or once a quarter, or whatever it's going to be. Uh, we use the product. Then we actually take the time to recommend the product. So recommending is something that you can say from a from sincere heart that I've used it. That's why I can wholeheartedly recommend it. And I, I recommend products even today that I don't get paid on because I use it and to, to my success, to the benefit of my own personal life. And I use it. And so I don't have a problem recommending it. Now, be, just because I choose not to be a part of the network marketing uh, uh, compensation plan uh, is, is probably some other, various other reasons. I'm an entrepreneur and a pastor, so I have uh, various things that I'm involved in, but there's uh, certain companies that I don't choose to be involved with, uh, and I still use the product, okay? So I recommend their product as well. And so people have a chance, and I, people say, why don't you just get paid and begin be to do that? Well, I've chosen not to do that. That's just that's my own personal choice. But there are companies that I, I'm involved in, that I do recommend their product. I do recommend their services as well. And I am able to be compensated. There's some that I still continue to get a residual income from as a result of having been recommended the product years ago. I'm still getting residual income from those companies. So, so it does work effectively if you recommend something that people get a chance to benefit from themselves. Then the last thing is this is sponsoring. And that, that's where probably people have the most challenges is getting ready to sponsor. Because in using a product, then you just pay for something that you like. That's real simple, right? You use a product. If you choose to recommend it, that's a choice. And you know, if you're not doing it on an ongoing basis, and, and some people, I don't, I don't go out about, I don't go out of my way to make recommendations for certain products uh, that I that I'm not a representative of, but I do recommend them on occasion when somebody is having a conversation about it or something comes up like that. But the companies that I'm associated with or organizations that I'm associated with that I really, 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 really believe in, I recommend on purpose because I'm an affiliate with that organization. I'm a representative of that organization, and I recommend it for the purpose of getting a sale. I recommend it for the purpose of getting people to actually make a purchase. And when those people make a purchase, I begin to talk to them also about uh, becoming a member themselves uh, of the network marketing opportunity and not just uh, have a being a user of the product. But here it is. I first want to have them experience the product for themselves. And so I don't put pressure on people to do anything other than experience the product for themselves. And, and that makes it a lot easier for them to identify if it's something they want to use or not. Now, the benefit, beneficial thing regarding uh, network marketing is that oftentimes you'll find a product, uh, once, in a while, once in a while you'll find a product, I should say oftentimes, but once in a while you'll find a product that 
cost, a flat fee, you, you buy the product, and then to be a part of the affiliate program or the network marketing program, there's there's no additional cost, no additional cost to be involved. And so if, once you desire to make the transition to recommendation, should somebody make the purchase of the product, you're able to be compensated. And you've had not to, you've not had to do anything to make that happen, other than just being a user of the product, and you're automatically an affiliate. Should you choose to activate that that portion of the business? So for now, you're using a product, recommending the product, and now sponsoring other people. Now, sponsoring other people makes it really, really simple because you find people that you want to use the product, right? Okay, then you find people that you want to recommend the product. If they're using the product well enough to recommend it and they feel comfortable about doing that, then they can be sponsored as people that use the product themselves and recommend the product consistently, and they sponsor other people too. So you're building now a team. And as you're building a team of people that are doing the very same thing, using the product, I'm saying this a lot because I want you to get it, it's just how simple it is. Use the product, recommend the product, and then also sponsor other people to do what? To use the product and recommend the product and sponsor other people. So that cycle goes on and on and on. You often hear the word about system and systems uh, that are online, such as utilizing the internet or you know, utilizing Facebook or texting or making phone calls or, or using uh, th uh, three-way calls, and that kind of thing, using your upline, uh, people that are uh, your sponsors above you to help you uh, close sales, if you will, to get people involved in your opportunity. Uh, that's all part of a system. That's all part of a system. And if you, again, recognize that there's a system for every team, every team has a different kind of system. But the, the three main things that are going to always continually happen is the use of the product, the recommendation of the product by the person that's using it, and thirdly, the sponsorship of people that come in and do the very same thing. So without those basics right there, understanding those basics right there, uh, you have a chance to succeed. But without those basics, uh, you'll probably not do well in the network marketing arena. If it's something that you just want to use the product in, just use it. Just go ahead and keep on using it, keep on using it, and refer it once in a while to somebody. And if you get compensated for it, fine, fine. If you don't, no big deal. Uh, but here, here's a here's a situation. If you align yourself with an organization and you say, you know what? I like this business so much. I like this product so much that I'm going to marry the two, the product usage and the sponsorship and recommendation. And product usage, the recommendation and sponsorship. I'm going to marry that together and begin to work it effectively. Now, here's what, what makes it kind of exciting for you. Beginning to do that every day. Go oh, find yourself texting five or six people a day, 10 people a day if you can. And this is one, one, one strategy is to text people that are in your phone, that you, people that you don't necessarily want to talk to. If you're new to business and you don't have a great conversation just yet, simply say something real simple like, just come across a way to save money um, on a new diet program I'm a part of. I've lost five pounds already. That's it. You didn't ask them for anything. You just started to let you know. You text that information to them and, they, and somebody will say, what is it? <laughs> okay, I haven't heard about that before. You never told me about that before. And they'll text you back. Now, some people don't respond, won't respond at all. But hear this. You know that the, they've seen your text. Unlike an email. An email is sometimes people have email and they get hundreds of emails every day. They don't check all their email. They kind of run through them and get rid of them or let them just stay there uh, because they have multiple email addresses. But they have one phone, perhaps one phone, maybe sometimes two maybe three, but sometimes most, most, most folks have one phone that you know of, especially a, a cell phone, and they're going to go through all of their text messages to find out what they are, at least, at least just to discover what they are. And so as they're doing that, you just send out a one little one little text message. They don't respond. That, that's okay. That's okay. Now, what I do, I use a list. I have a list uh, that I write down, and I have a list of um, uh, people's names, of course, and my, my top prospects are right, uh, top 25, top 50. And what I end up doing is uh, having yellow orange and um, and green are my colors yellow orange green actually a red too but yet the yellow uh, the, ye the yellow is for people that have actually taken the time to uh, respond back to me and I've, I've marked them in yellow and the orange are people that I've actually just sent the information out to but they've not responded yet okay and then I've got the ones that are a red they responded back and they said no okay <laughs> they said stop they, or they, they don't get upset. Most people are pretty pretty cool about it. And, and they say, thank you very much. I appreciate it. I'm not really interested in it. And they, they don't even know they're not interested in it because I'm not giving any really information. But what I typically do 
after a person has actually con I've actually contacted somebody and they respond back and say, what is it? I've never heard of that before. Or whatever the situation might be, it depends on what message I send them. I will send them a link. Uh, they have a chance to listen to right, listen to a video right away or listen to a phone call or expect a phone call from me. I'll, um, in most cases, I'm talking about texting. So I'm texting them an image, if you will. I'll text them an image of the, uh, like an ad that will give them a, a visual right away. And then there's a link there that I'll, they'll have a chance to click on the link and they'll see that same image again or something similar that will give them more information on a video. So they have the image initially that they see right away. And they have a chance to read through the ad, if you will, real quickly. And it explains a little bit more about what we're talking about. And then beyond that, they have a, they click the link, they can go right, right directly to a video that will give them a really good explanation of what, they, what they're looking at. So that's one of the ways that I go about doing it. Then I keep track of those people by, again, by, by my list. And I, I have my list typed on, you know, put something recommended, you actually write it out, which is good. Psychological thing to write it out, write it out. But I have mine typed up and on a Word, Word document. And I have 1 through 50, 1 through, 1 through 25, 1 through 50, whatever I'm doing there. And then I'll go ahead and, uh, again, I've got the ones red. Red red is indicating that they're, they're not interested at all. And then I've got the yellow that they've uh, taken a look at it. And uh, uh, we haven't got a response yet, but they've taken a look at it. No, we've got a response, but we haven't, they, they've not made a final decision yet. And then the, uh, the orange is for people that have actually just, just um, got, it, got it sent to them, but they've not responded at all. So that's how we go ahead, go ahead and do that. It's real simple, guys, and in reference to how we go about uh, doing network marketing effectively. Uh, use, recommend, sponsor. Keep repeating that. Use, recommend, sponsor. You probably heard this before. If you're new to network marketing, perhaps you haven't. But if you've been in the game for a long time, you've been rec you recognize that you, you break it down to what we really do. We use the product, we recommend the product, and we sponsor other people who do what? Use the product recommend the product, and sponsor other people. That's it. Real simple. God bless you. Have a fantastic day. We'll see you around. Have a fantastic day. We'll see you.